Former Game of Thrones co-stars Kit Harrington and Rose Leslie were married this weekend in an intimate church service in Scotland. Unsurprisingly, the guest list included more than a couple of their fellow cast members from the fantasy TV series, who gathered at Rain Church in Aberdeenshire for the proceedings. Peter Dinklage, Maisie Williams, Sophie Turner and Amelia Clark were all in attendance, alongside actor Maureen Ackerman, and Mumford & Sons members Marcus Mumford and Ben Lovett. Following the ceremony, the celebrations continued at Ward Hill Castle, a 900-year-old castle in northeast Scotland owned by Leslie's family. Upon leaving the church hand in hand, the bride and groom were showered with rose petal confetti before driving off in a car decorated with just married signs. Harrington and Leslie, both 31, met in 2012 while playing on screen lovers Jon Snow and Egret on the set of the HBO series. Leslie left the cast two years later and currently stars in the legal drama The Good Fight. After it was confirmed the co-stars were dating in real life, Harrington discussed his relationship in a cover story for Luomo Vogue, where he revealed that his favorite weeks of the series were the ones spent filming season 2 in Iceland alongside Leslie. Because the country is beautiful, because the northern lights are magical, and because it was there that I fell in love, he said. If you're already attracted to someone, and then they play your love interest in the show, it becomes very easy to fall in love. The couple hinted that their wedding would be traditional when they announced their engagement with a notice in the Times of London, which read, The engagement is announced between Kit, younger son of David and Deborah Harrington of Worcestershire, and Rose, middle daughter of Sebastian and Candy Leslie of Aberdeenshire. Speaking outside the family castle, Leslie's father said he was absolutely thrilled about the wedding. It's an absolutely lovely day for us, he said. Additional reporting by PA. Follow Independent Culture on Facebook for all the latest on film, TV, music, and more.